Hello guys, welcome to the debug arena. In this video, we are going to see how can we handle undefined null and empty variable. What does it mean? You can see here, we have a card. This card represents the information of our users and currently all the users have the same data. And uh, this card looks good. Now suppose if one of the user haven't uploaded his profile picture and the other has not entered his age, then there will be a mismatch in alignment of the card. Also, there will be the empty space inside the card, which will definitely affect our UI. So it is important to handle all that condition that if profile picture is not there, then what to do? If age is not there, then whether to show it or not. Also, if there might be a condition that any of the user has more data than the another, uh, another like uh, like this race might have a data of account number, Aadhaar number, telephone number. So all these things should be handled in a proper way. And how can we handle that? That thing we will see in this video. So without any delay, let's get started. Okay. Let's go to the code. This is the code of the website. At top, I have imported all the image required. Below that, there is an array in which there is a name, age and image and this is the structure of the card. Now let's make changes to it and see what happens. So suppose Ramesh has not entered his age and delete the age and just see what happens. You can see here that age come down. Like I had told you there will be a mismatch in the <coughs> UI. So you can see here. Now, now what, what is happening here that uh, we had written x dot age in x we are getting all the users data and we are accessing the age but for in the case of Ramesh Ramesh don't have an age so the javascript or you can say react indicate that it has a null value and it, and it returns null so let's see how can you handle that so as I said said that uh, javascript or react is currently taking age as a null so you can handle that by writing if x is equal equal to null then show this otherwise show age this is i am using ternary operator Let's save it and now you can see here there is a hyphen here like if you if user haven't entered the data then this type of marker will come now moving forward just like null there are other two undefined and the empty so let's see how can we handle empty and what is difference between null and empty. Null means nothing and empty means it has something like you can say it's it has something but zero. Like you can see here that Ramesh don't have age means his age is null. But Suresh has age but it has nothing zero. So when you come here you can see here that it ha age has hyphen. And Suresh doesn't have. So how can we do that? You can just use OR operator and just write another condition that x is equal to empty. Then also it will show hyphen. Now you can see the changes have been made and now it is looking good. This is how we can handle null and empty. Now let's go to undefined. Now let's add another field to Mahesh. Like I am adding address. Always remember if you are if a user has an extra data in the form of string, like currently add, uh, Mahesh has an address, but others others don't have address, then JavaScript will treat his uh, the address of a Ramesh as a null, address of a Mukesh as a null. So it will not give error. But if address will be an object, then it will give error. Like currently, you can see I am getting giving pin code, giving one more data add. Now you can see that address is not a string; it is an object. Now it will definitely give error. Okay, so. Let's access it. First, you have to access it in your code. Okay. You can, uh, yeah, address, a double address. 
x dot address dot pin code i am accessing the pin code so when i go here you can see there is nothing here and in console okay let me clear all the things out and refresh it you can see here we are getting this error cannot read properties of undefined pin code so the javascript is not getting this address for uh, ramesh mukesh and suresh like if i comment this to and this also then it will not give me error it will just show mahesh because it has all the things but but ramesh suresh and mukesh don't have so it is giving me error of undefined so how can we handle that also you can you have to notice here that it is giving undefined not for pin code like it is treating pin code as a null but it is giving us undefined for the address like if you write here address dot pin code is equal equals to undefined then so null otherwise this then it will not work because it is giving address as uh, address as not defined you can see here that the error is still here what you have to do is just remove pin code now you will handle it like if x dot address is undefined then show this hyphen otherwise show is pin code go here now you can see that the error is handled one more thing it is a good practice to handle all three of them like here ramesh don't have a age but react js is treating his age which is a string as a null but when you are writing code in react native it will treat him it will treat age as an undefined so it is a good practice to handle all three of them so let me show you with an example of image inside image i will handle all three of them here i am using a uh, or operator always remember to use it like this not just directly and if it is null empty or undefined then it will show this image empty i had imported it otherwise it will show image okay so let's save it let's remove image from here and here okay for ames it is null and for image it is empty for suresh it is empty so you can see here that both of the profile has been handled perfectly in this way you can handle all the variables properly and also it is a good practice to handle all three of them and especially whenever you are trying to fetch data from uh, any server online because you don't know which data is available or not so it is mandatory to handle all of them thanks for watching the video if you like this video helpful then please like share and subscribe thank you